months if you want to get your project started figure out where you want to have it at yet you know first and then go and do what mojo said which is go get the money go find a builder let them help you build it so that you can get it done expeditiously hey prophetess j renee um that way you can get it done pretty quickly so definitely you know you have to be creative guys as they mentioned as she mentioned you know cares act money one part of it just so be clear it's not that they um, acquired that money illegally is that if they did it through the eidl side it was based on their income that they made for the previous year so just think of it that way eidl loans they actually run your credit for however on the ppp side you could do the same thing and they don't run your credit but it is still based on your income from the previous year so keep that in mind if that's the route you want to go then that's definitely something you can do i mean that's creative financing right you know, if you qualify for, remember the EIDL, you got to pay that back. But for the um, PPP side, as long as you prove you used it for payroll, which this is not one of those situations, let me be clear on that. Um, you can't use that for rent utilities. Like that type of project does not fall under it. So don't play yourself and you be out building stuff and you tell me, I got my money, I used it for PPP. You will be in trouble. That's not going to work. Um, someone says the Florida area that you all are familiar with doing this. Um, be, be more specific um, because yes, um, it's possible. Yeah, because one of the articles um, was in from St. Pete. They do on micro apartments. Yep. With with containers, and I'm just like yes. Yep. Container like this credit. 